Hi everyone, and welcome to Power Plates. I'm Harry, and we're continuing our two-point hostel adventure with Rotting Hill. So, we're getting our third star in Rotting Hill. And I think we're on about 300 patients cured so far. We need 500 in total, have a reputation of 95%, staff morale of 95%, and a hospital value of 5 million. Please, please, please make sure that you watch my three, I know, all three of my Star 1 videos for this hospital. I guarantee it will be worthwhile. Essentially what it does is it sets you up for Star 2 and then Star 3. In this video, we're just going to be cruising to our third star. All we need to do is cure about a hundred more patients. So we're actually got a lot further ahead than I thought. I thought it was 300. We're actually in the nearly at the 400 mark. Now you can see things are starting to get just a tad bit busy, but we can we can get that through that. We only need to cure 500 more. We should be able to do that fairly quickly. So let's have a quick check there. We got this on the go. Lightheaded patients. We can cure one more. No problem. We need Cure over there, cure over here. There we go. 99 to go. And things are just getting a bit busy over here. Got a few people needing to go to the GP. Diagnosis on. Yeah, diagnosis on for both of them. And this is just a treatment only. So these cues aren't ideal. I'm just going to ride it out for now. Hopefully it's going to pass. We'll just keep an eye on it. So you'll notice our staff morale just keeps on kind of hovering around the, you know, the low 90s. And we need it to be 95. Um, but essentially what we'll do is when it starts to get up, well, once we cured 500 patients, essentially we'll just... Um, give everyone a pay rise, make everyone happy as possible, and then crack on. Will full. Two, two staff there. Yeah, so hopefully we can quickly just smash through these. Um, worst case, I would move this DNA lab and stick in a, another GP's office, but hopefully we won't get to that. Good, seven out of seven. Happy days. We now have 414. Oh, we got a death here. And it sounds like we got a ghost. Hopefully one of our challenges can sort that out. There you go. I mean, go for the sick or go for the ghost. Captured. Yeah, the standing. It's because of these cues here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put this back open for diagnosis. I think that's going to impact our cues on our GP's office. Let's drop you in here. We only got 75 left to go, so this should be a fairly short video. We have absolutely smashed it. In terms of training, two-point radio. Never heard Stan fall back career. Everyone trained. I really want this doctor to get to the next level though. Where all the celebs stay. So I'm gonna drop him in here. But having a hard time selling them. I guess I'll stick to playing records. A few more, and I should be able to train them for. Uh, DNA. So you can see the stats up there at the top. You can see student doctor. We got one star, and you should see that faint outline of the bar around the second star move. There we go. Got a cure, always good. So you can also go on here, and you can see that we need essentially 30 more experience points. 
So I'm just going to keep an eye on what treatments need to be done around here, and I'm just going to drop, drop them in. So we got someone coming for cubism, so I'm just going to drop them in here, and then we need, mm, they're going to get done, they're treated before we get there, so can wait. So you can essentially just watch um, this stat here. So you can see he's being, well, he's doing the treatment just in the background there, in the middle of the screen. You can see he's dropping in. Hopefully we get a cure, and we'll see that experience move up. Even if we don't get a cure, the experience still moves up. But I want, I want a cure so we can get close to that 500 mark. There we go. So you can see that got 10 experience points. So only to essentially cure, you'd say two more. Bins will become full. So just keeping an eye. Over here we have a nurse that can be trained. One thirty, one forty, one forty. It is. Still pretty high cues, to be honest. It shouldn't pose too much of an issue. All right. So we're in the turbo plunger. What have we got here? No problem. go. Another cure. Let's see what awards. Ooh, not that many. We, we haven't actually trained that many people because we're getting essentially to the top of our um, limit. Who, who we can train? We, we've, we've not got that many spaces. I mean, look. We're getting there. We're, trying, we're training as many people as we can. Just keeping an eye out. Cubism, there we go. So I'm just gonna pick this doctor up, swap them. And hopefully that should mean that this doctor will get to the next level. And we can train them in DNA and then build another DNA lab. I think that'll be a good idea. While we're here, See if we can pass this emergency. Only, yeah, only forty-one more to go. Ooh, we got yeah. <laughs> killed them. <laughs> but they are essentially ready to be promoted. One more, and we're good. Nurse, please go to the pharmacy. Yeah, let's not have the nurse leave whilst we're in the middle of the emergency, ideally. I can't be bothered to look for this but more here, so I'm just gonna cancel it. And hopefully we'll cure this one and we'll all be good. Nope, not gonna have them go to the GP's office because they are not a GP doctor. Oh yeah, and we cure three, so we'll smash it there. Just waiting for someone to need a doctor treatment room. Hopefully soon.
gonna be. Yeah. Oh, we actually hit 10 million hostile value, which is exactly what we need for the um, final hostile level. Here we go. Let's get you trained. Stamina training. Hoping that someone's gonna come by soon. 481. Okay, there we go. Let's drop you in here. Come on, staff morale. So, staff morale, the easiest way is essentially to increase uh, pay. That, that's going to be the, the, the easiest way. Um, if you make everywhere attractive in the hospital, that's also going to help with staff morale. So, for example, we could put a large fountain down here and here. That's going to help with staff morale. If we stick one here, also, so you can see already that's bumped up to 95. No problem. Let's take another one down. See 96. You make sure everyone's well paid. And now let's get this one. Training genetics. But we probably won't have time to actually complete that training because we should be getting the third start any minute now. We're at 496. Could probably do with another GP's office just looking at those queues. And by the looks of things, probably just be easier to do this. There we go. And there we go, three stars. That easy. Congratulations, your hospital's been awarded a three star reign by the Two Point Health Ministry. Who would have thought, when you took over this hospital, that we were in store for such architep. architeple? No idea. Rags to Rich's tail. Now that we. <laughs> now that I put in those terms, I find it quite sickening. Ah, there we go. Absolutely smashed it. Too easy. Too easy. And all you gotta do is wait. Just be patient. You'll you'll get for it. If anyone's struggling, um, do let me know down in the comment section below. Um, let me know what you're struggling with and I can give some extra tips. Um, but if you follow this guide, it should be fairly straightforward. Um, do make sure you watch the earlier videos. That's gonna make it a lot, lot easier because um, you want to build that foundation early on and get it nice and steady. You don't want to be trying to chase hospital value when you're struggling with the money. I mean, I got nearly 7 million in the bank. I ain't struggling for money. We got finished with an 11 million hospital value. Absolutely smashing it. I got a profit of a million over the year. Easy. Absolutely easy. All right. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, make sure you keep liking the videos, comment down below, let me know how you found this, and I'll catch you on the next episode where we take on Pelican Wharf. Thanks for watching, bye for now.